What's up, the John Squad? You know that DCT is one of the world of wrestling Wednesday. So sit back, relax. I'm going to talk about WWE Monday Night Raw like I do on every Wednesday for you guys. And then I'm going to break down the AEW Revolution results for you guys right now. So we're going to break down the Monday Night Raw. And then we're going to talk about AEW Revolution that happened this past Sunday on March 5th. So here we go. Sit back, relax, and happy Wednesday. Enjoy wonderful world of wrestling Wednesday. So here we go. So let's start off with Dead Monday Night Raw. So, Raw, so we kicked off Raw Monday with Solo Sudoku versus Kevin Owens. And Kevin Owens beat Solo Sudoku by DQ after Jimmy Uso interfered. After the match, what happened after the match was that Solo and Jimmy continued to attack Kevin Owens. But Sami Zayn makes the save. And then Sami Zayn tried to get Kevin Owens to... um. To, to join forces with them, but Kevin Owens leaves the ring and backs away. So then we had a backstage from Bobby Lashley. Bobby Lashley says he went to SmackDown last week to confront Bray Wyatt man to man, only to find out that Bray is not a man and that he sent. That he sent Uncle Howdy to do his dirty work. Lashley asks, What will it take for Bray to face him like a man? So that's going to be interesting, man. I'm loving this feud. So we had Bianca Belair versus Carmella. Bianca Belair beats Carmella. After the match, Carmella and Chelsea Green attack Bianca. Asuka comes out and spits blue mist in Chelsea's face. <laughs> that was funny, man. I got to be bad on Monday. That was kind of funny, you know. It's pretty funny. And we had a Seth Rollins and Logan Paul segment. And, the, and Seth Rollins versus Logan Paul is now made official for WrestleMania because the says Seth Rollins wanted the Miz to... um. Make that match official WrestleMania. Go pull the strings backstage. But then, a a after the match was made official for WrestleMania, Logan Paul sucker punches Seth Rollins and knocks him out. Now we had o Omos versus Dolph Ziggler. And Omos squashes Dolph Ziggler in a match, man. It seems like that Ziggler just turned to a job or something, man. I just feel so bad for Dolph Ziggler, you know. I mean... It is what it is, but then after the match, MVP says that Brock Lesnar will regret putting his hands on him when Omos faces him at WrestleMania. So we had John Grano versus Finn Balor, and John Grano beats Finn Balor with some help from Edge, right? After the match, after the match was over, Edge takes out Finn, Finn Balor with a spear. Then we have Piper Niven versus Nikki Cross, and Piper Niven beats Nikki Cross in a match. Then... Also, there's some breaking news that's happening too. That uh, we're having the king and the king and queen of the ring tournament, Saudi Arabia, on May 27th in Jedi Saudi Arabia. That's what we're having. So we had Austin Theory. Also, we had we had an Austin Theory promo that happened. So then Austin Theory says that he has a gift for John Cena and challenge him to a match at WrestleMania and. Offers to put the United States title on the line. John Cena dis dislines and says that he has no interest uh, in him. Cena claims that Theory has no heart and soul and no one cares about him. Cena says that his gift for for his gift his gift for Theory and it's that he will let him leave. So then, so then John, so then Austin Theory mocks Cena, uh, bald spot, and says that Cena was his childhood hero, and it's and this what they say you don't want to meet your heroes. So then John Cena says back to Austin Theory. Cena says that he rather be bald than have them pipe in fake crowd noises for his matches like they. Do for theory and let and they and he John then John Cena lets Boston decide if he should accept and the fans cheer yes 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 and that he should that 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 should and Cena accepts the match. So that's gonna be a good match. So then we well, then John Cena introduces Cody Rhodes and Cody Rhodes gets the John Cena seal of approval. So I guess Cody Rhodes is the new face of WWE now. I'm saying I mean guess that is true, but it is what it is. But anyway. Cody Rhodes is like the new face of um, WWE now, so that's why he's going to win the belt at WrestleMania, Cody Rhodes. Then we had Chad Gable versus Baron Corbin, and Chad Gable beats Baron Corbin. So we had Damage Control versus Becky Lynch and Trish Stratus is now made official for WrestleMania. 
So the next Monday on Raw we're going to have is Edge calls up Finn Balor, Bianca Belair versus Chelsea Green, and Elias versus Bronson Reed. So we had Sami Zayn versus Jimmy Uso, and Sami Zayn beats Jimmy Uso after Jay Uso caused a distraction. After the match, Jay hugs Sami and tells him that he's with him. But then, next thing you know, boom! What happens next is that uh, Jay Uso turns on Sami Zayn and mocks him for believing that he would pick him over his family. And la and then Raw ends like that with with, with the with the blind Cody Rhodes is staring face to face, and that's how Monday Night runs. So now it's time to break down the AEW Revolution results for you guys. So we had on the AEW Revolution pre-show we had Marsh Briscoe and the Lucha Brothers, Penta L Z Milo and Ray Phoenix defeated Arian Davari and the Val and the Varsity athletes Josh Woods and Tony Nese. Okay, so now we so now A A W Revolution kicked off with Ricky Starks versus Chris Jericho. Ricky Starks defeated Chris Jericho by pinfall. Then we had Jungle Boy Jack Perry defeated Christian Cage in a final burial match. Then the House of Black, Malachi Black, Brody King, and Buddy Matthews with Julie Hart defeated the Elite, Kenny Omega, Matt Jackson, Nick Jackson. Um. So the House of Black are the new AEW Tag Team World Tradition, and that should have been the start of it, man. That should have been the new start of everything else that should have came. The House of Black should have been the AD, first ever AEW World Trio Champions. Then we had a three-way match for the AEW Women's World Championship. I mean, Jamie Hader, Jamie Hader, um, with Dr. Br Britt Baker, DMD, defeated Saraya and, and, and Ruby So. Then Ruby Soho. Turns heel after the match, and and joins forces with Soraya and Tony Storm. So, can't wait to watch AEW Dynamite tonight. Gonna see what happens. We had Hangman Adam Page defeated John Moxley in a Texas Death Match, and it was by submission. Then we had an AEW TNT Championship match. Warlow defeated Samoa Joe by technical submission. Then we had a. Uh, Four-way tag team match for the AEW World Tag Team Championships. The Guns, Austin Gunn and Colton Gunn defeated the Acclaim, Anthony Bowens, Max Caster with Billy Gunn, Jay Lethal and Jeff Jarrett. They defeat J Jay Lethal and Jeff Jarrett, and then and also they also defeated Orange Cassidy and Dan Housen. So then for the main event of AEW Revolution, we have a 60-minute Iron Man match for the AEW World Championship. We have MJF defeated Brian Danson, Brian Danielson, and a four out of three. In a sudden death overtime. So that match is pretty good. But anyway, once again, John Swift, thank you for joining me here on my AEW. I meant Wonderful World of Wrestling Wednesday. Sorry about that, guys. Wonderful World of Wrestling Wednesday. And. You're all the best, John Squad. You're all one of a kind of each and every single one of you guys. You mean a lot to me. Thank you. Thank you for tuning in every Wednesday to enjoy Wonderful World of Wrestling Wednesday. So once again, please like this video. Leave your comments down below and subscribe for more. You're all the best, John Squad. You're all one of a kind of each and every single one. Peace out, the John Squad, and God bless.